While most of us worry about Lyme disease or Rocky Mountain spotted fever, scientists believe the bite of the Lone Star tick is the cause of a very unusual condition. After an allergic reaction sent Dean Cecil to the emergency room in 2016, an allergist was able to diagnose him with an allergy to red meat caused by a tick bite. He now carries an EpiPen and must avoid eating pork, lamb, and beef. I used to love to grill out, you know, your hamburgers, your steaks, your ribs. Well, those items are no longer on my menu. It's not entirely clear to scientists why a bite from the Lone Star Tick can trigger an allergy to the carbohydrate alpha-gal, which is found in red meat, or really how common this allergy is. But it's important to know it doesn't happen to everyone who gets bitten by this tick. Right now, the Lone Star Tick is found mainly in the southeast U.S., but their habitats are spreading, and they can be found as far north as Minnesota and Maine. While not all ticks carry the same diseases, at least one variety of disease-transmitting ticks can be found in every state. black leg ticks spread Lyme disease, which is the most common. About 300,000 Americans develop Lyme each year. One way to avoid a tick-borne infection is to prevent tick bites by always using an effective insect repellent. Consumer Reports intensive testing of repellents found products that contain between 25 and 30 percent DEET are best at repelling ticks. You'll want to thoroughly check yourself and others for ticks after being outside and shower soon after you come indoors. For extra protection, toss the clothing you wore outside into the dryer on high heat for 10 minutes to kill ticks that might still be hanging on. Avery Cotton, 8 on your side.